guys and welcome to my channel. If you're new, my name is Kristen and today I'm be decorating my front porch for fall. I am so excited about the way this turned out and I cannot wait to show you guys how I did it. So uh, yep, let's get started. Okay, so I just wanna show you guys a nice little before of the porch, before it was decorated, because what is a decorating video if you don't see the before? So I have a really long, long porch, but I am just gonna be working on the door area. And while I was doing this, I realized the door is not centered in between the pillars, so it was a little more complicated than what I thought. I picked up Mums from Meyer. They were $5 for the large ones and three bucks for the smaller ones. And the pumpkins were from Walmart and those ranged from three to $5. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna be doing is adding this ladder to one side of the door. It is a really old wooden ladder and it was from a garage sale for only $1. And then I'm be adding some rugs. I've had this bottom rug for a while. This was from Gordman's. And then the Happy Fall Y'all truck rug is from Burlington Coat Factory. I just made this wall hanger. It is super, super cute. I will leave the link for that in the description box below if you guys want to check out how I made that. And then these old windows were from my neighbor. She just gave these to me a couple years ago. And this chair was from Goodwill for $3. And it was just a quick little makeover. So I'm going to show you guys real quick what it looked like before. Uh, it was like a still a black. Uh, some of the paint was coming off. And I just really just wanted to make it over just a little bit. So all the only thing I did was spray it down with a hose. And then I took some spray paint from Walmart, the 97 cent color play spray paint, and then just spray painted it black. Aren't you tired of the drama? You use your words like they are knives. Mm -hmm. I don't need that type of drama. And trying to be tough. And then next, I'm just going to be putting the mums in some of these pots I have. This was a birthday present from my grandma this year. She always finds me something old, and that's just what I love getting from her for my birthday. I don't know what it's called. I want to, It looks like a little cauldron, but I know that's not what it is. Um, and then and now I am just taking some of my Ray Dunn pots, and I am putting more mums into these ones as well. For the day. And I have another one of these little buckets. This was from a garage sale. I actually picked up three of these for only a dollar. And then I am just laying all this out how I want. I had to rearrange this probably a hundred times because it took me forever to realize that the door was not in the middle of the pillars on the front porch, which was quite annoying. I will not lie, but uh, regardless, I love the way this turned out. This birdhouse was a dollar at a garage sale and Presley was out here helping me. So you're going to see her in the video quite a few times peeking her head in and out. So I knew when I was decorating the porch that I wanted lots and lots of mums because I think they're so pretty and so colorful and I knew that the porch would look plain and sad and lonely without a bunch of these. And like I said, I didn't have enough pots to put all of the mums in so I had to just keep in what they had. I didn't really think it was a big deal. Uh, but yeah, I just, this was me like trying to figure out what I wanted to do. And it's so funny that you're just moving flowers around to make it look a whole lot different. Whole lot different. Okay. Um, the, uh, the pillow is from Walmart. And I just added that to the chair. I was going to actually put something on the bottom of the chair, uh, like some kind of decal. But I changed my mind and then just left it plain black. But like I said, I'm just sprawling all these mums out from the door all the way to the end of the porch, moving them around a little bit. No, I didn't take the tags off. I still need to do that. And I'm sorry for the views, but <laughs> um, I guess I didn't know where else to put my camera when I did this. Probably should have rethought that out, but uh, it is what it is. And then the pumpkins, like I said, these are from Walmart. 
I think I really want to rip these open and keep the seeds because these are pretty expensive. So I think if we grow them ourselves next year, it will save me so much money. But I love the ugly looking gourdy pumpkins. I think they are super fun and they just leave, I don't know, just, I just like them. So that's why I bought them. You're looking at me so cold. Here I am once again and changed my mind to where I wanted to put everything and I actually ended up taking that off of the ladder off the top because we have such bad wind here and I knew that it was eventually going to blow down and I did not want to ruin my Ray Dunn pots so I put one of them on the lower just in case and then like I said I did take the one off the top. And then the last thing I did was just add some little pumpkins to the ladder and down here as well. These are also from Walmart. You guys, that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed my decorate with me. I know it was pretty simple and easy, but it brings a lot to the front porch and I am so excited that I was able to get this done when it was still nice outside instead of freezing out. I think last year I did my porch video and it was super, super cold. Uh, but yeah, like I said, that's it for the video. If you like this video, if you like this video, and I'm going to say video 100 more times before I end this. Um, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And if you are new to my channel, I would love if you guys hit that subscribe button down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Be yourself, are you for real? Mm -hmm. are you looking at me so cold? One's love is now So feel better by taking me down Once I fell, but now I'm strong, I'm ready